today our focus is of course is a continuation of the condition or a continuation of uh, this specific condition but of course our focus today is we'll talk about the psychological effects of premature education among men at the same time not only to men but of course towards his own partner So this is going to be a brand new episode of this channel and of course this is in continuation of our previous vlog and of course we, we've mentioned about in our two succeeding uh, in our two previous vlogs about a specific condition that is actually timely and at the same time it is going to be affecting uh, men that's going to be talking about premature ejaculation. So today our focus is of course is a continuation of the condition or a continuation of uh, this specific condition but of course our focus today is we'll talk about the psychological effects of premature ejaculation among men at the same time not only to men but of course towards his own partner but of course uh, our priority this time is of course for us to take into consideration the possible effects of this premature ejaculation with the couple so in order for us to easily remember this specific effects or such psychological effects of premature ejaculation so I've made a mnemonic and it's gonna be the mnemonic premature so it's the same as with letter I it's composed of the following letters that are P R E M A T U R N E so this is composed of nine possible negative effects or possible effects of premature ejaculation towards this um, concerned individual at the same time towards his own partner so let's begin with letter P P is presence of impaired oh, quality of life. So, of course, uh, if an individual is actually experiencing this uh, premature ejaculation, so, or, or a man or a man is actually experiencing this one, of course, there might actually be instances that it might result into a possible impaired quality of his own life. It might actually affect his work, it might actually affect his studies, and at the same time, it will actually affect his own perspective towards the future. So, in that note, it might actually be going to have a negative impact towards his own quality of life. Not only his own quality of life, but of course, it will actually affect the quality of life of his partner at the same time his or her own uh, uh, sons and daughters in the future so because that's gonna be a problem then towards uh, satisfaction of a physiological want or physiological need among partners so that is letter P let's now have letter R letter R is relationship issues grow so there's a possibility then that uh, if there will be a, of course a partner or your or main partner is going to have this problem it will actually going to cause the possibility of an emergence of relationship relationship uh, issues because of course um, probably your female partner will actually going to try to uh, embarrass you or probably uh, have his or have her own possible reasons regarding your sexual performance so in that note it might actually going to increase the risk of you to have this relationship or marital issues that's letter R relationship issues grows let's now have letter e letter e is erosion of sexual self-esteem oh, so this no. erosion it means that there will be degradation of or degradation of or decreasing level of sexual esteem sexual self-esteem uh, of that individual especially if uh, he is actually experiencing this condition so it's actually going to be good that we're going to offer ourselves towards this individual because of course we have to boost his own self-esteem or self-confidence in order for this individual not to experience being uh, alone and sad and at the same time it will actually prevent this patient to undergo this uh, stage of depression so that is letter E letter E is erosion of sexual self-esteem let's now have letter M marital intimacy fails so of course uh, if uh, this problem is emerging or this problem is actually present uh, it might actually going to create then uh, marital problems especially or marital satisfaction is actually going to be a big issue it's because of course uh, a man will not be able to satisfy the needs of uh, his own wife at the same time probably this could be a possible reason why uh, his own wife will be looking for someone else because of course this might actually going to be a ground for for this man to think that uh, her own husband will not be able to satisfy her need uh, sexually. So that is letter M, marital 
uh, intimacy fails. Let's now have letter A. Anxiety and stress to both oh, no. So of course, uh, if there will be presence of this structure regulation, this will actually going to uh, develop or this will actually going to increase the risk of the development of stress anxiety on both partner. So stress in the part of uh, the man, but at the same time stress in the part of, among the woman. Because of course, this will actually going to have problems then in their own possible sexual satisfaction. So in that note, uh, it may actually going to have a negative impact towards their own relationship. So of course, in that note, anxiety and stress might actually going to emerge. So that is letter A. Let's now have letter T. Letter T oh, is no. their own sexual uh, satisfaction fails. So of course, uh, it is actually stated that there is a possibility that if there will be premature ejaculation, you will not be able to uh, satisfy the needs of your own partner. So of course, in that relationship, of course, in that specific relationship, uh, th that will usually create a possible negative impact towards your relationship, uh, towards your relationship together. So that is letter T, their own sexual uh, pleasure actually fails. Let's now have letter U. Letter U oh, is no. uh, usually leads to another sexual dysfunction. So most of the time, rectal dysfunction or uh, premature ejaculation is going to yield into another sexual dys dysfunction and it's gonna be involving paraphilia. So of course, there will be possibility of this individual to have fantasies and at the same time, uh, thinking that there is actually going to be uh, something is actually happening or sexual ple pleasure involving inanimate things or probably you know, just gonna be touching objects because of course they have with them uh, this problem on all about premature ejaculation so that is letter U letter U is usually leads to another sexual dysfunction let's now have letter uh, R letter R is relationship and, oh, pain, uh, no. relationship and pleasure fails so of course another effect of this specific problem is the presence of this relationship and pleasure uh, failure. Of course, in that note, it means that uh, this could be the possible reason why a partner or a couple might actually going to uh, result into a separation because, of course, uh, the presence of this uh, premature education is actually present or experienced by uh, the wife's husband. So, of course, the most important reason then for this uh, wife to do is to understand the feelings and emotion of uh, her own husband. So that is letter R. Letter R is relationship and pleasure. Ah, relationship and pleasure fails. Let's now have letter E. Letter E oh, is no. embarrassment and depression. So of course, according to studies that we've mentioned, uh, another side, so another effects of the presence of this uh, premature ejaculation is it might result into embarrassment because sometimes, uh, especially if there will be involvement of quarrels in the family or quarrels at home. So your partner or your wife may actually get name divulge this information towards the public or something like that so it might result in the possible embarrassment at the same time this will result into greater level of sadness and loneliness and it's gonna be presence of depression so this uh, psychological depression is gonna be uh, importantly being managed because it might result into the possibility that this man might actually result into possible suicide ideation so that's letter E letter E is embarrassment and depression so these are the nine possible uh, psychological negative effects of your premature ejaculation. So first, to, to remember this one again, let's have a recap. Let's now have letter P. Letter P is presence of uh, impaired quality of life. Letter P is presence of, a presence of uh, impaired quality of life. Letter R is relationship issues grows. Letter E is uh, uh, erosion of sexual self-esteem. Letter M is uh, marital relationship fails. Letter A is anxiety and stress to both partner. Letter T is their own sexual pressure fails. Letter U is usually leads to another sexual dysfunction. Letter R is uh, relationship and pleasure fails. And of course, letter E is embarrassment and depression, of course. So these are the possible side effects or the possible effects of the presence of this specific condition, which I'm sure. Uh, premature ejaculation. So the most important thing that uh, I can leave as an advice is for this partner to uh, to understand and at the same time to extend uh, her presence towards uh, her own partner. Because of course, a greater problem then is gonna be present towards the man or towards this, uh, towards the husband. 
So it's good for 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 this part for this wife to support the partner at the same time, uh, offer a great form of understanding that this problem is gonna be having specific control then, and there is a possible management of this. Okay, so this is all about the effects or the psychological effects of your premature ejaculation. So I hope that I've given you some information that's actually vital in order for us to uh, get rid of or in order for us to know uh, the possible psychological effects of premature ejaculation. So if you are new to this channel, if you're, new, if you're actually new to the Nurse Success channel, please don't forget to subscribe, hit the subscribe button, click the notification bell, and at the same time, don't forget also to like and share this video if you want others to know about this. And of course, don't forget also to comment down below on what are your perspective with regards to this condition. So this has been Nurse Jose. Thank you so much for watching From Nothing Towards Something. Bye for now.